November is National Alzheimer's Awareness Month, and a new therapy developed at Texas A&M University offers new hope for those facing this devastating disease. Researchers have formulated a nasal spray that could delay the progression of Alzheimer's by years. Marcelina Benito has the details for us. Len and Mia, this is exciting new research happening just up the road in College Station. As you know, 7 million Americans are living with Alzheimer's in the U.S. right now. And something as simple as a nasal spray could provide more hope for families facing this life-changing disease. For families facing Alzheimer's, it's all about time. More time with your loved ones. It is potentially possible to postpone the mental decline by about 10 years. Now new research from Texas A&M's College of Medicine offering more hope. Lead researcher Ashok Shetty and his team have developed a nasal spray that's shown to delay disease progression. It is very promising based on the results in the mouse model. The spray found to decrease damaging inflammation in the brain and reduced buildup of plaques in the brain, key characteristics in Alzheimer's disease. This initial phase conducted only on mice. We are very hopeful uh, that it would also work in patients you know, when it is ready, but it's a, it's a long route. Shetty and his team of researchers have filed a patent on this application already. The work at A&M, just the latest in Alzheimer's research progress. Kasunla and Lakembi are two other intravenous drugs already on the market to treat and delay Alzheimer's disease. Dr. Shetty believes the potential ease of a nasal spray could be a game changer. Once we prove that it works in uh, Alzheimer's patients, I think uh, eventually it can be a very simple process in terms of delivery. So it can be a simple nasal spray or an intranasal administration in a doctor's office. So it will be a very non-invasive process. Shetty tells me he plans to test the spray now on larger animals, and he's already expanding his research to see what impact this could have on Alzheimer's patients in later stages of the disease. Back to you. This is certainly encouraging news for all those who are dealing with Alzheimer's, dementia, neurodegenerative diseases. Marcelino, thank you. Yeah, very much so. Right now you can stream our Alzheimer's special hosted by Marcelino as he takes a look at the impacts of this neurodegenerative disease, getting expert advice, caregiving tips, and support facing Alzheimer's. It's available to watch right now on the KG11 Plus.